Hi guys and welcome to another replay. I'm in my Kamikaze R again and this has been going on for oof, nearly seven minutes. As you can see, I'm well hunting uh, carriers. I went up through C, didn't meet any resistance. We capped it, uh, two cruisers on the field. And we made it up here, so yes, shooting at the carriers. And I'm saying shooting although this is a torpedo boat. But, well, this guy is coming against me, so I could use torpedoes against him. But other than that, I, mean, I am protected either way, so I might as well use my guns. I switched targets because, well, as I said, he's coming against me. So, easy to take him out and finally launch him here. Saving one, hopefully these four will kill him. And I'm following the other one. He's trying to escape. This guy here, I'm not sure what he's trying to do, but uh, <laughs> yeah, whatever it was didn't work. But um, looks like the Langley there. I think it's a Langley. Um, yes, dive bombers. So we have my steering and whatnot. So repairing that. And firing again with my guns. I am detected anyway. So. I lose nothing by doing this. His steering. And he's on the fire from the cruiser as well. So, yeah. He's turning a bit there, so launching more torpedoes. But, yeah. Boom. Didn't kill him. But almost. Flooding, fire, it was my kill, so it has been fire, so it must have been flooding. Either way, got a kill. Now, uh, ouch, I didn't give to the bombers, that actually hurt. Um, my repairs on cooldown, good. And since I'm here, I'm still being detected by planes, which is unfortunate. Oh well, I put out the fire trying to get away from these stupid planes because they are still detecting me. Speaking of, I think that was a dying wish of the torpedo bombers. Not sure why he aimed them at me, but well, I guess he wanted revenge. Oh well, I missed those easily. So I'm coming from a mile away. Okay, so that being done, I'm a bit of quiet time looking at the two teams. We are behind, which is not good. They have a hundred points more than us. They have two capture points, we have the last one, the C. And they have lost both carriers. Thanks to me. Oh, I had some help. But still. So we need to either camp or sink, because if not, well, uh, these torpedoes are mine firing. There was a guy behind the island. I could hit him, I could miss by a mile. But again, pretty fast reload, so why the hell not? The only problem is now that he's behind the island. Is he close? Is he far away? Which way is he coming around? So if he comes this way around, he's definitely going to attack me. But well, my smoke is not on cooldown, so... Eh, worth the risk, I suppose. And enemy battleship. Ooh, and there's the cruiser. Eh, didn't hit him with the torpedoes, but well. Point spread here. And he's sailing away, so... They don't have the reach. They only have seven kilometers. So unless he turns back this way, not even close. So next target here, that battleship. Why the hell not? He's on full health. And the score is still about the same. We do have one more ship. They do. And that's a bit of good luck. One. Two. They weren't even aimed at him. 
Oh well, we'll take it. The cruiser is coming back. He's going to beat us again, and the cruiser is coming, so I am protected now. And for that so reason, popping smoke. Cruiser this close. thing is that the battleship, if he's paying attention, should know that they're incoming torpedoes. Let's see if he is paying attention. And while that is going on, might as well pummel this guy with his immediate threat. Again, two hits on the battleship. And I got the kill. Now that he's dead, the smoke is between me and the cruiser. Here, I probably should have turned the other way. Now I am detected, and he is probably going to want some kind of revenge. Can't blame him. But well, there's the island, or an island, and I can get into safety. Unless I beach myself. It would be embarrassing. Shit. Yeah, I wasn't paying attention. Oops. But well, stop shooting here, and. Ouch. Looks like armor piercing. Didn't hit him with my torpedoes though. And ouch again. Oh well, no longer detected. So let's motor out of here. And that was close. Mine fired, but still close. So, we're now winning. Not by much. And we are camping B. So, yeah, it's starting to look better, but. Still not convinced. Kind of strange that they have that many points, considering we have the two carriers, we have the battleships, we have three more ships than they do. Uh, maybe I should have paid more attention in the beginning. I guess they got to camp for a long time. Eh, well, point is we're winning. Come on, let's get B. I'm going to help Ninja Cap be here so I get some extra points. Tempting to open fire here, but uh, he is at my maximum range and he would detect me. And I am on low health. Well, well, I'm telling the team that I will try and see if I can capture A. And looking at the map, well, two guys down south. Destroy on a cruiser and the last cruiser is up there going for A. So we know where they are. So if I can either kill this guy up here, I can take A and nobody will be able to stop me. Which is good. And it looks like our carriers are running for the hills, which is good. And they should. Oh dear. He's coming this way. He is going to detect me. And turn in time, but he's not shooting at me yet. Well, that will change. Nice way to beat us here. I missed him with my guns, so they're all going to miss. Yes, it comes. Oh, look, he's turning and slabow. Yeah, he shouldn't have turned. Oh, well. Yeah, that was a mistake. Oh well, as I say in chat, oh well. And actually there was a little bit of uh, chat going on there, when I said I would get A. The guy said he would back me up, so teamwork. And that's it. Okay, so looking at the results, that earned me nearly 260,000 credits, 4,500 experience. And I actually managed to do just a tad more than 100,000 damage, which is nice. 47 hit with my guns, which is nice because it's a Japanese destroyer, so I'm famous for that. 8 torpedo hits, killed 4, 2 fires and some flooding. So, overall, pretty neat. And the two teams, I finished first. Hooray for me. But anyway, 1700 base experience, guy number 2 in the Kaiser, 
got 1400, which is also very nice. And then 1100 next, and actually the team did pretty well. If we compare compare to the enemy team, only the last guy on our team, the Omaha, got less than uh, the other team because the second last got 699, and the best on the other team got 685. So pretty solid performance from everybody, which is probably why we ended up winning. So yeah, good all around. And here are the ships that I damaged. Actually I killed everything that I damaged, which <laughs> well, was a coincidence really. But uh, Kaiser, 38,000. Uh, here's my torpedoes. The two carriers, 27 and 17,000. And the cruiser, I did 17,000 too. So pretty neat. And actually 26,000 from main batteries, that's nice, 70,000 from torpedoes, uh, to be expected, and only 5,000 from floodings and fires. But well, I think that was an overall good game. It was kind of boring in the beginning, which is why I left out <laughs> sailing through sea and, well, all the way up to finding their, their carriers. But well, I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, bye bye.